After logging into Cybersphere, click on the Courses menu at the top. Expand the Course category to choose your course. Click on your course name. In the Courses page, press Turn Editing On. You will see the Add a Resource and Add an Activity drop-down lists. You will see a block called Quick Create at the top right. Select the topic in drop-down where you want to add your quiz and click on Link Quiz. By adding a new quiz form, enter the quiz name and the description. In the timing options, enter the availability of the quiz. For example, the start date and due date of the quiz. Also, the teacher can set timing for students to take the quiz. Choose the options for re-attempts by students. Click Save and Display. The quiz questions editing page will be displayed with the question bank at the right side. Click on Questions tab. There are several question types available. Select the multiple choice from the drop-down list. Give the question a name. This helps to identify the question later from the question bank. Enter the question in the question text field. Use this field to describe the question. Set the default question grade, for example, the maximum number of marks for this question. Set the penalty factor. If you wish to add a general feedback, this is the text that appears to the student after he or she has answered the question. Choose whether students can only select one answer or multiple answers. Choose whether to shuffle the answer options. Write your first answer in the choice one text field. Using the HTML editor makes it possible to add an image or a sound file in the choice one text area displayed. Select a grade percentage for the answer from the drop-down list. This is the percentage of the total points for the question that selecting this response is worth. You can select negative percentages as well as positive percentages. So selecting a correct response in a multiple answer question may give you 50% of the possible points, while selecting a wrong answer may take away 10%. Note that in a multiple answer question, the grades must add up to 100%. If you wish, you can add a feedback for each response. Fill in the rest of the response choices in the, cho in the rest of the form. Any unused areas will be ignored. Fill in the overall feedback fields if you wish. You can give rich feedback to students by adding images, audio, recordings, or videos. If you are using the HTML editor to create a question, you can click the image icon in editor toolbar. This will pop up the insert image window. You can choose to upload an image into your files area from this window, or you can add the URL of an image on the web. If you add a file to your files area, click the name of the file after you upload it to insert the link into the URL text entry at the top of the screen and then click OK. You can also insert sound by clicking the speaker icon in the toolbar. You can embed YouTube videos by getting their embed code and pasting it via the HTML code editor mode. Click the Save Changes button at the bottom of the screen. The question will be added to the question bank and you can preview the question from there. You need to select the question and click Add to Quiz button. To add the question form, to add the question from the database, After you add question to quiz, click on Info tab. The quiz details will be displayed. Click on Preview Quiz Now button. The preview of the quiz will be displayed. To update the quiz, click on Update this quiz button on the top. Clicking on this button enables to modify the settings for the quiz. Note that you cannot modify the quiz settings once the students have attempted the quiz.
This is how quizzes can be created in the course.